Good morning, you lovely people. It's Friday. Yeah, for most people, it's going to be the end of the week and maybe hopefully the start of the bank holiday for you. Uh, Bob's doing well. Hello, Bob. He's been flitting around the tank today, so he's looking quite happy there. He seems to prefer like being around where the filter is and going up and down in the air current. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, another latest night. Last night, by the time I got the the video edited and uploaded, um, oof, must have been about ten past one, quarter past one, something like that. Um, went upstairs to bed, watched an episode of Person of Interest, then started watching a second one and fell asleep. And Denise woke us up to say, oh, TV's finished. So <laughs> that was something like about half two when she woke us up. Um, but then I got woke up this morning by somebody dropping a pair of shoes on the laminate floor and downstairs, which like woke me up pretty quickly. So I've been up since about five past eight, which is actually really early for me at the moment. So yeah, and Denise finishes early today. And finishes at half one, then Georgia finishes early. Then it's the start of the weekend. Yay! There was something I was going to say to you guys and I cannot for the life of me remember what it is. Um, no, it's totally, totally gone. Uh, oh, so forgetful at the moment. No, I'll get back to you when I remember what it is. Yay, got my coils. Coils have turned up my new coils. If anybody doesn't know, for e-cigarettes, it's the bit that goes in there. It's the bit that heats heats the liquid up. And it's got to be replaced every so often because they either pack in or they burn the liquid literally and it tastes horrible. So, yeah, I've got them. And please, they turned up really quickly as well. So, uh, yeah, I remembered what it was I wanted to, to say. I would just like to say... A huge thanks to all of my subscribers, um, everybody out there for subscribing to my channel. I'm up to 81 subscribers now, yay! Can't wait, I uh, really want to hit 100, a big 100. Um be really nice. I, I I can't believe like I've got this many subscribers. I know it's only 81. A lot of you out there probably got loads more than me. But um, I remember when I had my old channel, Coffee and a Slice of Life. Uh, I was absolutely amazed when I reached 50, then 100, and uh, couldn't believe like people subscribing. You know, <laughs> so, who the hell wants to see me? You know, it's like I do this because I love doing this. Um, ma making videos, I enjoy it. Uh, something I find fun, talking to the camera, um, doing the editing, and having the the communication with you guys. You know, in the comments and on Twitter and Google Plus or Hangouts or whatever. You know, getting getting to know you guys. Um, I find it really fun. It's uh, but it's just me. You know, it's me and my. My family and our wacky, mad, bog, bog standard life, you know, it's nothing, nothing special. So, I, I'm really surprised I've got 81 subscribers. So, let's hope I can get them 19 more subscribers and get up to 100. I'll be absolutely chuffed to bits. Um, and I'm constantly looking for, for new channels to follow as well, new, new vloggers, but for some reason these days. It doesn't seem as easy to find vloggers because I, I like the the personal type of vlogs, you know, like family life, people's the personal vlogs, um, like daily diary type of thing, you know. Oh, put my feet up, uh, rather than the the ones which are sort of like <laughs> the big names where they've got the studio setups and all that sort of thing. I'm not interested in all that sort of thing. Um, so I like to find the the more sort of like the normal vlogs as I call them, and they're really hard to find. Uh, I don't know why. Um, just 
So I keep checking every now and then. I'm coming coming across a new one and checking them out. And if I'm liking them, I'm subscribing. You know, but at one time used to be really easy to find, but not these days. So and plus, they like, people don't upload videos as often as what they used to. Uh, a lot of the time when I was on Coffee and a Slice of Life, uh, you'd go on and there'd be lists of videos that people have posted overnight, you know. And these days, uh, people might not post for weeks on end or months or whatever, you know, but that's just the way YouTube's changed over over time. So, But I still find it fun doing this and messing about with the camera and... Letting you guys see the the normal sort of mundane things that we do. So, but anyway, yeah. Thank you very much, everybody. Uh, it really does mean a lot, and I very much appreciate it. Well, it's about twenty-five past eleven. Uh, I'm trying this on the GoPro for once, <laughs> just for a change. Um, I can barely keep my eyes open. Uh, Denise finishes at one o'clock, so she'll be home by half one. So I've got to try and get myself an hour's sleep. So I'm a bit more refreshed when she gets home. Ah, out in the garden, lovely sunshine uh, up there. And my beloved is here. <laughs> yes. Yeah, three off, days. Three days. Three days off. Yeah. Get in. Get in. Well, we're going to the creme over the weekend, aren't we? And we might possibly pop down to the quayside, depending on the weather. Is there anything else you want to do? Um, salt the garden. Salt the garden. Yeah, yeah. get rid of all that cardboard as well. Mm -hmm. So we can sit out in nice weather. Well, <laughs> at the moment we're not getting it. It's a sunny, rainy, hailstone, windy. Tomorrow's <laughs> supposed to be nice, I think. Is it? Oh, good. Especially if we get down to Whitney Bay and we'll go to the Rendezvous Cafe, have a cup of, <laughs> cup of tea. Yeah, it'll be nice on the seaside. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it would have been my brother's birthday on Sunday, on the 24th, so because we're not going to be getting down to Whitney Bay on that day, we're going to pop down tomorrow and put some flowers uh, on his grave and we'll nip along to the Rendezvous Cafe because it's all down on the seafront at Whitney Bay. So we'll nip down there. Hopefully the weather is nice. Uh, yeah, fingers crossed for that. So I'll catch you guys. What's this here? Later. Hey? Is it in a minute or is it later? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's still getting used to the, the, the channel. I'll catch you guys in a minute. <laughs> I'm bloody knackered. I'm going to take my hoodie off. It's getting a bit on, a bit on the warm side. <sighs> Just been moving a shed. Absolutely shattered. We've had to take it apart, move it, and uh, gonna have to rebuild it now. Oh. <sighs> Sorry, not much to say. I'm busy having a breather and a cup of coffee. I don't know if you can see me, Denise. Papa. <laughs> we built a shed. We built a shed. Courtesy of our neighbours, uh, Richard and Elisa. We thank you very much. Much appreciated. Ah, it's good fun, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Dead easy. Happy. Mm -hmm. Filthy when uh, clean it. And when you do what? Clean it. Do what? What's the hand action there? Clean it. <laughs> 
Yeah, well, it's not too bad actually, considering it's been out. The top maybe's blasted down, but it's still not as bad as like what ours is. So, well, happy. Yeah. So, that's that's my man job done for today. So this is getting done tonight. The head's getting sharpened. Hmm. Uh, I might even have a shave as well. End up looking like Steve says, like a twelve-year-old. <laughs> have a proper shave. Uh, what about you? Yeah, I'll have a shave as well. Oh, okay, don't. <laughs> Decide if it's gonna rain. Uh, yeah, it's um, sort of get a bit breezy and it's coming in gloomy there. Mm. And I've just noticed my camera's on wide. I have no idea why. I shall change that back. There we go. Hopefully that looks a bit better now. Um, for some reason, it changed itself to nine. 20 or 940p whatever it is and gone on wide angle um, but I'll put it back on the 1080p uh, changed it again so it's now 1080p by 60 rather than 48 God. I don't know what I've done maybe I've pressed the because it's got the touch screen on the back of the GoPro so maybe I've pressed the menu by accident I don't know uh, pizza and chips tonight can't wait guys, can't wait. Yeah, no I can't. Yeah. Mmm, pizza. <laughs> Chips. Mm. Um yeah, so Georgia tomorrow. It's going with her friends to go and see one of the new chick flicks at the movie. The, whatever the heck it is. There's a big one of the movies, I can't remember the name of it. Got no interest to be honest. Chick flicks. Yeah, that's a moped. Uh yeah, me and Denise are going to nip into town, get some euros, then nip down to Whitley Bay to go to the creme. And then back home. So, yes. Hello. <laughs> into the shop. Got chocolate. Got bread. Having a bad night, aren't we? Or diet wise. Pizza and chips. Yeah, pizza and chips. No, <laughs> I don't know if that's bad or not. Yeah, don't know. Don't know if it's bad or not having pizza and chips. But it actually, sounds quite nice to me. <laughs> sounds nice, but not good for the diet. Maybe there's a Chinese takeaway. <laughs> but it's damn tasty. <sighs> Love you. <laughs> You'll go all giggly when I say that. <laughs> I'm buzzing. Oh, oh, she's buzzing. She's buzzing. She's buzzing, everybody. Oh, your Fitbit. Yeah. Was it good for you? I <laughs> <laughs> is getting my hair cut. Zoom it, Henry. Get it all off. <laughs> oh. Come on, then. Get it zoomed. gonna be bald to the what you guys out there this is uh, and girls if you want this is the cheapest way to have a haircut buy some decent clippers and that's it you save a fortune they paid for themselves within the first few haircuts How's it looking, everyone? How's it looking? Good. Shiny. Shiny. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hi. 
Are you alright? Yeah. Oh, somebody's not feeling very well. Mm. I feel like you know when you get to Hey, Yeah. 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 Mm. Also, it's fun because I'm going to my friend's house for my life. So, you're yeah. done. But it's also fun because I'm going to my friend's house for my So, I hope that it goes by the time I go. Yep. I'm going to the cinema and my wedding night is staying at his. What are you going to say again? Pitch Perfect 2. Who? Pitch Perfect 2. Pitch Perfect 2. Yeah. Told you it was a chick flick. It's not a chick flick. It's, it's just like a, a... It's a chick flick. It's a comedy. It's a chick flick, isn't it? It's a Is it? It's a comedy yeah. and like a singing thing. Like a musical thing. Like a dance. Yeah, but it's... it's boys aren't going to go and see it, are they? Probably marking it towards girls, which makes it a chick flick. Oh, that makes you dizzy. You don't spin around on the chairs if it's made you dizzy. Ooh, leave me scalp behind. <laughs> Jeez. Just trying to take the top of my scalp off. Is that alright? I think so. What do you think? Hey, look at this. Shakshi. <laughs> what do you think? Shakshi. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> well, guys. That time again. I think it's going to be time to call it a night because uh, I've got a few, quite a few clips I need to edit before I go to bed. And I've got things to do tomorrow, so I can't really do it in the morning. But we've had our first ca casualty in the fish tank. Little, um, I can't remember what they call them, booba or whatever, whatever they call them to call them. Um, the little pleck. Uh, pleco or whatever they, they call the things they like go down the bottom of the tank sucking up all the rubbish and up the side of the tank and things like that uh, basically cleaning the tank only got him this afternoon and then he just started like floating on the top of the tank like it was dead then all of a sudden he would twitch then he would come back to life and he'd swim around quite merrily then sometimes he would be spinning around and spinning around and go down to the bottom of the tank and he was banging into the other fish then he would float back up to the top as if he was dead then he would do it all over again this went on for about an hour and a half, two hours. Um, then all of a sudden, I think he, whether he lost his strength or what, I don't know, he uh, just sort of floated to the top and didn't move again. So he poking him, prodding him, and making sure that not a thing. But when I picked him up, he was quite stiff. So um, poor thing, it looks, looks like he he died. I had no idea why. Um, I did earlier speak to the shop the, the fisher got one of them's dead already and he said that it could be the trauma of like the transporting them home in the bag maybe um i don't know but i'm gonna i think i might have to get a testing kit or something for the tank just to check the all the the levels chemical levels and all that sort of thing in the tank um not chemicals it's chemicals but like the normal sort of water chemicals alkalines and all that sort of thing whatever whatever it is that you got in there but I think I'll need to get a test in one. But the other three fish seem quite happy there, swimming about quite merrily. It's just that one, the little pleck. And it was out of a cold water tank in the shop. Um, so it's not a case of it's been in warm water, because I know plecks are naturally warm water. Um, but this one had been in a, been climatized to cold water in the shop and quite happy in the shop. Brought him home and he just died straight away. Um, so a strange one, but you know, uh, they said they said just being the receipt and they'll give us another one. But I think that was the last one. But might see if, see what else they've got. But uh, yeah. So anyway, that's the first casualty. Bit sad, but there you go.
But I want I fancy getting a, a bigger tank. Not a massive huge thing, um, but a bit bigger than the one we've got because I think Bob, our fish, uh, our fantail goldfish. I'm not sure if the tank is maybe just slightly too small. The other two are okay, but him because he with his tail is a good six inches long. You know, the body is about three inches, and he's got like three inches of like this big floppy tail, and uh, I don't know, it's just sort of swimming round and round and round. The other two are going like crazy, but <laughs> but we'll see. Um, I've seen, I know there's one uh, in Whitley Bay where we're going tomorrow. There's the one that's on three cycle or three eagle. But it's got a leak and needs repairing, so I've been checking how to do that, and it looks quite simple. Bit well, a bit fiddly, but you know, it's doable. So I don't know whether that, but it's a, it's a four foot tank. I don't know, maybe it's too big. Um, maybe like a two foot tank would have done. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Anyway, so that's that's pretty much it for today. Um, hope everybody's. I had a good Friday and don't forget it's the weekend. Hey! And everybody have a great weekend and bank holiday. And I'll speak to you all soon. Bye for now. Well, guys, just while Denise is making me a cup of tea, or making us a cup of tea, hopefully, I forgot to tell you before. Actually, little reason to celebrate today. I, I totally forgot about it. Um, Actually, today is two years I've been off cigarettes. Yay! I'm well happy. Um, Woohoo! She says, yeah. Uh, been on a cigarettes, but I've been off real cigarettes for two years. Uh, well worth it. So, yeah, apart from saving an absolute fortune on cigarettes. Um, so, since the taste back energy levels, all that sort of thing, apart from the medication and everything obviously, but under normal circumstances. But it's uh, well worth it. Um, so yeah, and Denise, Denise was uh, two years in January, so well done Denise for January, I know it's a bit belated. <laughs> it's like coming up to the end of May now, but well done for January. <laughs> but yeah sir, two years. So yeah, yay! Big thumbs up, yay! Stop smoking two years. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I didn't realise you were going to yawn there. <laughs> get the get the purple light off your face, sir. <laughs> yay! Have you, have you told him about the casualty? Yeah, told him. Yeah, the first casualty of the tank. Yeah. Who oh. are they? It's so fit. Uh, the other three, the other three seem to be okay. They're swimming around, chasing each other and all sorts, you know. Uh, yep, that's good. But anyway, this time I am away. I shall catch up with you guys soon. Bye bye.